Don't leave that highest. Yeah, I'm not leaving it. We're chilling. We're gonna get this. We're gonna get this. Hey, Tic Tac. Tic Taz Tic. It's a fun name to say. Thank you for the follow, man. Appreciate it. That's the penthouse's main entrance. Another okay, way it could be through the construction shaft at the top of the stairs on your right. Down on the ground. Bum, 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 bum. The bedroom uses an electronic lock. I can hack it through the local network if you get me a strong We'll get it. We'll get it easy. Uh, sorry, I was checking chat. I all tabbed out. Bum, 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 bum. Is there any particular reason you're doing this loud? Because it has really high add density, which means I can get XP for weapon kills in here. Because I've gotten a lot of my challenges done already, but I need to get challenges done if I want to keep leveling up. And I'm only at 18 out of 21 skill points. So right now, we are at the part where we're like scraping at the bottom of the barrel, trying to get some XP. So, we're just doing loud missions. Just trying to do some loud missions. Get some kills. Plus, I mean, if I get this done overkill solo, loud from the start, that's also just content, you know? It's also just content. Love the challenges for clear map 150. Yeah, I know. Those challenge. Who, what? Who made those, dude? Who made those challenges? Done. Clear a map 175 times on overkill a difficulty, a loud. Like what? What are who? What are they doing, something man? Happened. What are these challenges? <laughs> They're trolling with that shit. Oops. Got my pathing all screwed up. We want to go upstairs. I don't think the hostage rescue unit's going to come in in time, so we're chilling. But we want to bring all of the ads. See what? That's what I mean. Like, I can lock this door in place, so I can shut it right here. But if I shoot the handle out, I can't move it anymore. And neither can the AI. So I can just constantly have that door's cover. I wasted the shield! All the AI should be rushing here, and when Vial gets here, we should be almost But we can start killing them off. And start getting the police assault down. Once I clear myself a path here, we'll go grab the thermite. Zapper is dead. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about them. Being. I know people have been asking me lately how I feel about them being called zappers instead of tasers. I don't know how I feel about it. I think I'd prefer tasers, honestly. I mean, it's not not a huge deal. Not a huge deal, but some people have been asking me that lately, so. Let's go ahead and eat some of that for me, will you? Locate the key card. Defensive 
Ah, uh, damn, did they get him out? Dallas is down. I think they got him out of here. Unlucky. That's all right. We'll the just drill it. Indicate there's a panic room hidden in the office. Find it. The there should be a switch Light or something. I guess it was to be. You guys really freed Mason, huh? Wonder if this spot's any better. We'll try this spot, see how it goes. Jane's about to drop. Is a challenge to use Mason though? I've used Mason plenty of times. Excellent. They're backing off. Just don't let your guard down. They'll be back. Stay in Get you up, Chins. Get your ass up. Medic bag. Get past up here if you need. They really get him out, huh? Weird. Oh well. No murder for fuck's sake. Hoxton's gone down. More cops on the way. They're in 30 seconds. Thank you. Found a key card. One more minute. Where is this cloaker? I'm scared of him. Alright. Got him. I whacked the cloaker. Alrighty. Let's go. Looking pretty clean so far. Looking pretty clean. I just don't want them raffling down onto that balcony. That balcony is scary. Timer, timer, come on. 30 seconds. Yeah, we gotta bail. We gotta bail. Too long. Too long of a time. We'll run to the bathroom so we can funnel them all. Bodies. Yeah, I definitely like touch the sky the most. By the way, guys, if you're coming here to, uh, if, you're, if you're trying to get some kills for your weapons, touch the sky just has such nice add density. You just get so many kills. If you're trying to get those challenges complete, or you need to get killed with certain weapons so you can get more account XP, this is a great place to do it. <laughs> Not this time, bitch. We'll drop armor here real quick. Armor boost right here. They got one of us. If we I <laughs> Oh, we got Hoxton back just in time too. Let's go. Type in the vault code. Uh for eight four five. Does this shit never end? 
cover me, boys. I think we have good timing here. I'm pretty sure the police assault's like about to end in like the next minute or two here. Especially if we keep the kills going. So we should have like perfect timing for this, ideally. So that right when we collect the SSD from the computer, we can have a break in the action and then call in Bile. the whole team. Pack is turning big. Asshole, so tough. A little worried about how this is going to turn out, but... We just have the dreaded cloakers that I'm worried about. Eight heists? Yeah, there's eight heists in the game right now, guys. Eight heists in the game. That's, I think that's a pretty healthy number for launch, honestly. Pretty healthy number. We're gonna get more throughout the year. We're gonna get more throughout the year, and they've stated that there's gonna that's be both paid done. and free. Beautiful. That that's the they timing we were looking for. That's like the exact perfect timing I was talking about. No way. I just saw that cloaker. <laughs> I saw you spawn. You weren't going to sneak up on me. I would have been so sad if that's how it ended. Free heist and Major W? Yeah, there's going to be both free and paid heist. Keep that in mind. Both free and paid. They're coming in 30 seconds. Get ready. How long you got, file? How long we got here? You know what? The smartest... Should be able to see you. Alright, I think if we want to play this safe, we should hide in the bathroom up here. That way we can de-aggro them from the drop-off. I smell bacon. Oh. No! <laughs> Thank god they respawned in time. That was terrifying. Zapper, zapper. I got the zapper! Um, Just pick up the transmission. The cops are about to launch a final assault. You don't mind paid heist so you can buy heist passes? They're probably gonna sell, like, they're probably gonna do, like, what they did here. Like, so if you have gold edition, I'm sure you can buy it separately, too. Alright, I wanna. Let's go. Let's get out of here. And there we go. Touch the sky, solo overkill, loud. That's what we like to see. I'll show the build afterwards. I know people are going to be asking about the build, so we'll show the build as well. Bum bum. Okay, 13 minutes, 38 seconds. Of course, we aren't going for all loot. That would be adding way too much risk to it for now anyways. We'll see. We'll see if we can pull it off at a later date. But yeah, we're running the SA A144. That's the weapon. Currently, all I have on it is a uh, viewpoint sight. That's literally the only attachment. And then we have the bison, uh, the only attachment I... Well. Payday 3 moment, am I right? <laughs> no, we'll, we'll go over the build again still. <laughs> oh, God. So, yeah, we got the bison. I'm running the sniper. I don't really use it. It's just, I have it. Armor bags, necessary 100% of the time. Flashbang, necessary. Uh, I didn't really use it in that last run. I, I could've, I should've, I just didn't. Way better than any other throwable in my opinion. Infrasonics are kind of just what you take. You're not really gonna be using them too much though. Let's get skills. So I have Medic Aced. 
this isn't really important right now. The reason I wanted to ace this is because I wanted to pair it with combat medic. So we level up one more time, I get combat medic. And then anytime I revive someone, I'll get five seconds of damage immunity. And five seconds is a really long time. So yeah, wanted to do that. But ammo specialist is a must. Scrounger is a must. Plate up is a must. These are important. Scrounger is just amazing. You get your throwables back on kills. Uh, plate up, really important just for survivability. You get ammo. Uh, you get, sorry, anytime you have grit, ammo drops will instantly regenerate your current armor chunk. Super strong, super strong. Uh, mower is a must. Uh, every 35 bullets you shoot, you gain edge. It's not really important for that. It's a must because you want ammo funnel and replenish. This is how you basically have infinite uptime. Uh, like you have, you have not infinite uptime, but you have like infinite ammo almost. Because anytime you kill with ammo funnel, it uh, adds, anytime you run over ammo, it adds it straight into your magazine rather than your uh, your reserves. And then Replenish makes it so that anytime you kill an enemy, instead of having to pick up their ammo box, you just automatically pick it up when you kill them. These two have phenomenal synergy, really strong. It just makes it so you basically, every time you get a kill, you're reloading a little bit of your magazine. And then we have Tank. I think this is almost a must-have. This is a must-have, yeah. You have to take this. Not because of its perk, necessarily, but because you need it in order to get armor up, which I think is necessary. So you gain two chunks of your armor whenever you take an armor plate from an armor bag. Really, really strong. Sharpshooter Aced is a must. This one will give you 100% uptime on edge. You will never have your edge go down if you ace sharpshooter. You don't need to get a kill, you just simply need to hit a headshot and it'll refresh your edge. Really strong. Really, really strong. And then I like to take long shot so that I don't have any damage fall off on headshots. And then cutting shot is also essential. That armor pen, I don't know its exact amount, all I know is it does make a difference. If you're running a castigo, for instance, this is what makes a difference between being able to one-shot regular enemies to the head or not, is cutting shot. Super, super important to run cutting shot. Demolitionist isn't as important, but I'm running it for flashbang radius. And then uh, cooker is pretty important. I mean, I'm running demolitionist for cooker here. I didn't really use it too much in that heist I just did, but having a way to get grit just off the bat, really strong. And then... These aren't important either in the heist I just did, but I was going for a hostage takedown build there. I just wanted to level up my DMR a bit, so that's why I wasn't really using the Bison. Uh, CQC Specialist. Uh, you could ace it so that you get grit. I'd probably ace it, uh, but it's not really too important. If I'm planning on maining the DMR, I'll probably spec out of this in all honesty. But if I am going to use the Bison a bit, having human shields really strong. So I would probably ace CQC Specialist if I wanted to focus on my Bison. And then take Soft Assets and Pin Polar so you can have increased movement speed while you have a human shield. And yeah, that's about it. That's about it. That's the build. Thanks. Thanks for uh, <laughs> listening to my TED Talk.